So I was leaving the parts store and noticed someone spilling more oil in the engine bay than in the fill nozzle. Welcome back to your home garage and in this video I'm going to demonstrate three easy ways of holding your oil container but truly it comes down to atmospheric pressure. First off, always remove the foil cover. It's best not to risk having any of that foil dislodge and fall into your engine and use a funnel for additional measures. Now you've likely experienced some sort of hiccuping or gulping when pouring oil. When oil is poured from the container, the pressure is now lower in the bottle. Once the pressure in the bottle is lower than atmospheric pressure, air forces its way back into the bottle. This equalizes the pressure and the oil flows again, which is what gives you that hiccup or gulp. The shape of the bottle can help you control the hiccuping or gulping, but really it's about equalizing the atmospheric pressure. Not that spout up or spout down or even sideways is the best. They all work. Some bottle designs help you get to that 90 degree angle faster than others, such as this offset. In this particular bottle shape, spout up pouring lets the oil sit below the opening, which in turn lets in the necessary air to equalize the pressure, and then you get a smoother pour. In this case, spout down, you risk oil dripping down the container because you can't get the right angle to pour it nicely. So you hurry it up to get a better angle, and then it gulps. Turning the container sideways also gives the oil a bigger area to disperse its volume, which in turn allows better air intake to equalize the pressure. Sometimes the design of the engine bay minimizes how you're able to hold the oil jug, so using one of these three methods should assist you when filling the engine oil. There you have it. Hiccup or gulping is caused by air being sucked into the bottle and temporarily halting the flow through the nozzle. A slow pour or holding the container at a different angle will help to equalize the pressure in the container. So make sure you help to keep this channel going by hitting that like button, sharing this video with a friend, also please comment below as I reply to all, plus don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you next time on Your Home Garage.